we had to reach out to Puppy and get him out here. One of the uh, uh, top two players from MDBA. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely. And um, not, we have a uh, Neo too, the Ken, which is also just another character we don't see a lot of representation of. But um, Ken's scary. Yeah, and Nito has actually had some great local results as of recently. Um, Wanna hat over oh a uh, bunch of great players. Uh, yeah, and he he is pressuring <laughs> Pape right now. And usually Squirtle's the one doing all these low percent combos, but man, yeah. Nito is coming up, and we might have to see the switch to uh, Ivy pretty yeah, soon because he needs some of that weight. Yeah, I think he was actually just searching for a grab there, but couldn't get in on Ken there. Uh, Nito with all the calls, but these back air strings <laughs> coming out. What is this right now? Uh, and vine whip connection after everything. That was no way. <gasps> no, that's so unfortunate. I feel so bad for that Nito. That is tragic. I I'm not too sure which way Nito was denying those back airs. I'm pretty sure that's not a thing, but I could be wrong. I don't know too much about Ken. Maybe just the perfect weight, perfect size. I don't think but that's true. I uh, I definitely know that directional air dodge was uh, very tragic. He, he was just so close to the ledge, too. Uh, you, you hate to see it go down like that. So unfortunate, because he has such a strong lead, too. But OK, kind of you know, better now that he was able to even that up. It didn't really take too much for only 6% here. And, and again, the Squirtle coming out here. And you know, seems really comfortable, actually, uh, against this character. Oh. My goodness. <laughs> Yeah, Puppe, you definitely had to switch there because you know Nito was looking for something nasty to kill you. And Ken, definitely a character that is known for being <laughs> able to kill you very, very early. Yeah, definitely wouldn't be surprised if he died at 80 there uh, for sure. But okay, really nice focus there uh, to land back onto the stage pretty safely there. A really good possession, just really waiting it out, holding shield here. Nice patience coming out um, from Nito here. Puppe kind of having to be the one to uh, go in first here. Oh, man, and Puppet, you got to watch out. Ivysaur, another character known for getting extremely Ooh. early kills. And there what? is the setup. Nito taking him straight off the top. Puppet returning with the backer. He wants to get this edge guard, but wow, no jump on Nito. Very nice return coming out from Puppet. Okay, yeah, uh, Nito actually just kind of hurting himself here off stage here. Can Squirtle redeem himself? Because right now, Squirtle <laughs> definitely seems like dead weight. <laughs> At yeah. least Zard got a kill right there. Okay, oh, yo, all right, one. all right. We got a little something going yo, on here. Yo, 40%, okay. definitely uh, the most percent Squirtle has put on this entire game. Yeah. Okay. All okay. Right. Nice switch, actually, to Ivysaur there. Oh, man. And just like that, look at all the control Puppe has on this final stock. Nido has been fighting the hard fight this entire time. But wait a minute, gets an opening here. Tatsu not going to follow up with anything afterwards. And again, this offstage situation. I always get scared when Nito's sitting at the ledge over there. OK, really nice patience in shield here, kind of looking you know, for that down tilt there, kind of throwing out all these feet, foots, and hands. <laughs> yeah, he, he's, he's out here to fight. Oh, but there's oh, okay. the up smash out of shield. And wow, strong enough to take Ken right off the top, man. And that was with Nito SDing at like 60%. So that was. Very, very close, considering, like, this is a unranked player in SoCal. Currently unranked Ken in SoCal. Yep. And this is Pup A, like, PG, I don't know exactly what number on the PGR, but a top 50 player in the world right now. So very, very close. Um, I'm not too sure if Pup A knows this matchup. Uh, not a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, definitely. Uh, and not to take away anything from Nito, but like because Ken's not a character that's easy to play. Ken's yeah, a very no, hard very character technical. to play, so it's not going to be a very popular character. And even if Ken was a popular character, there's probably not going to be too many players that can play it to some extent of what Nito's playing him at. Right yeah, now. I feel like, uh, it, especially with Squirtle now, we're kind of seeing him perform a little bit better here. I feel like it probably was, you know, like we were saying, not having the knowledge against Ken here. Again, not a lot of characters, uh, players, uh, excuse me, people play this character in general. So again, oh my god, that um, Squirtle being one of the lightest characters, if he had a little you, more rage there, I feel like that definitely probably would have taken it that early. That was scary. Had you, so much knockback. You gotta be careful. <laughs> with, yeah. with, with the Squirt, you gotta be careful, man. Squirtle, very light Pokemon. Oh, very nice back air. Again, oh, again. these back airs coming out <laughs> here. Definitely oh, trying to get the grab, though. Yeah. Ooh, and look at the shield pressure coming out from you. That's the scary thing about Ken. It's like, against the Shotos, you want to camp them, but Ken is quick on his feet. So yeah. it's a lot harder to camp Ken rather than Ryu, because Ryu is just so much yeah, slower. Yeah, he's deceptively fast, too. And um, also, oh, OK, really nice back air call out. Almost going to be enough uh, to take that first stock there. Nito, so doing a really good job. This should be it there. Yeah, yeah. really nice follow up um, with the last connection there on the pair. Nice stuff. Yeah, and that, that uh, focus, very uh, unique mechanic uh, to the oh. Shotos. 
Um, you can take one hit and you'll armor through it no matter what the hit, but once you take the second hit, you'll get hit out of it. So very similar to the Street Fighter 4 focus. But Puppe, maybe getting a little desperate, but no punish onto the Flare Blitz. Why is he opting for Charizard right now, too? I feel like Ken still has so many multi-hit mm. attacks here, and he's still opting to stay with Charizard here. Oh, okay. Let's see it. Oh Let's my see it. Wow! Uh, Kill Charizard! Nido, Nido actually going off right now. I'm so sorry. He's actually putting in mad work, and I don't know why Puppe opted to keep out Charizard here. This is looking really scary and a really good opportunity for Nido to get a good uh, Are you dead? Game. Are you dead? Okay. He almost, he died at around that percent. Puppe's Zard at 100, and he's scared of death. That's wild. Yeah, no, this is actually a really scary situation for Puppe. He's going to get that forward throw. We're going to see proper ah! back here. There we go. Yep, there we go. Stage. Nice edge guard. And, and that's where the Shotos can be weak, <laughs> the offstage. After you do that side yeah. beat, you're very laggy. You saw Puppe take complete advantage of that. The up tilt almost connects, almost catches the landing, but here comes the flamethrower racking up all that damage. Yes, Ken's so scary, dude. He can just kind of like wait and shield, and he has that uh, presence that's so scary. You know what he's looking for, too. Puppe, Ape. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Really scary Watch for out. Now. It's a bad situation. Still has two stocks, though. Yeah, yes. wow. That's crazy. Needle's up in an, yeah. an entire stock. He's. Nito is big chilling right now. He's up on the top right 50 now. player in the world right now. And like you said, this man isn't even PR. Please, if Nito like does this right now. Okay, not going to get the fair. He's so close Ooh. to connecting this up tilt. He just needs yeah. one hit. He needs one tilt and he convert it. But right now, Puppy playing so slippery on the Zard. Really Use nice the focus. focus off stage. That was a really nice. So recognizing the was going for those back airs off stage here. Nido really just needs something, a one hit here. This should be enough to close out the stock. There's the focus stack landing really safely onto the stage here. Again, Can bad make positioning. Back? Yes, he does. How does Puppy land all these back here? This is wild. Gets the flame on the tail there. The side tilt will take him right off the side. Now, I've seen Pokemon Trader. He is uh, very good at making comebacks, but that's going to be it. Okay, okay, okay. I was going to say, po Pokemon Trainer is notoriously known in the community as a robber. He'll come in and get the quote-unquote undeserved wins. Of course, I mean... Zard and Ivysaur are very good at taking stocks extremely early, uh, so that's more so just people being and, and, salty. But yeah, yeah, like we were seeing there too, almost kind of bringing it back. Obviously, uh, it was kind of surpri surprising Nido had those two stocks still, but Puppe, you know, definitely showing his own, wasn't out of it, and uh, yeah, it was uh, close at the end. And honestly, we have a game three situation, and we're actually getting a little bit of a crowd too. Um, everyone coming to watch in. So if uh, Nido takes this, this is actually going to be amazing and a really huge uh, win on his belt. So I'm, I'm actually super excited to get into this third match here, starting it off on Smashville. Here we go, guys. It's crazy because Nino had such a huge lead, but Puppe was still doing a really good job of coming back. Yeah. So I definitely wouldn't count Puppe out just yet. Squirtle not doing too hot on this stock. Oh, wait, are you Ooh. eating the chop to the down what? air? What is happening? We Damn. need to clip that in the chat. Nito actually flexing right now. Dude, Puppy just got stuff. sauced. Like, you got obliterated there. And jeez, Nito is going to ride this momentum. He's going to keep on going. Right now, Puppy has the Ivysaur out. He wants to get this stock. He's sitting at around 80%. Ivy can definitely do the trick, but Nito doing such a great job of avoiding these kill setups. Oh, here comes the damage. Nice into the Tatsu here. All that damage, 35% already. Oh. And again, the pressure at the ledge here, not afraid. Dude, that, that Nair was looking scary because I thought Nito was going to convert it. Wow, he gets a Hadouken and said definite miss input there. Probably wanted some kind of oh. oh, Okay, yeah. Uh, I mean, I'm, what, what are you going to do, though? You know, the limited option, recovery options. Had to go for that Tatsu to get back onto the stage. Really nice down air. Call out there from Pepe. Yeah, nice focus. Okay, 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 okay. I thought he was going to SD there, but really good stuff. There it is, the setup. Are you dead? No, Zard has the weight to survive in this situation. That's what Puppe needs. He's a chunky boy. Definitely going to live at this high percent, 132. But again, look at the shield pressure. That's so safe. Yeah. Okay, so just going to go shield. low. Ooh. Puppe trying to get the down air. He's trying to kill this man at 45. Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's what he's doing to meet here. The situation's looking very scary. Again, seeing Puppe in this disadvantaged state here. Nito. Wow. You know, it's so funny. Okay, there it is. Yo, Nito giving him the stanky wow. leg, and that's his tag right now. And, man, he's definitely <laughs> giving him the kicks. <laughs> oh, yeah, I didn't even see that. That's actually hilarious. But, again, yeah, the Ivy Sword coming out, too. And, again, I'm uh, going to see a lot of, uh, you know, Razor Leafs being thrown out here. But yeah, Nido doesn't even matter. Quick 42% here. And again, this is where we see the damage rack up so fast. The shield pressure having to let go here. That's so safe. That is so safe. It's actually a crime. What do you, are you do? You're that was dead. It. Wow. You're dead 
off the top puppy oh gets upset from an unranked SoCal player. SoCal Nito. here to play. We were just talking about it yesterday. Uh, SoCal underrepresenting, but here, as we're seeing, maybe this is going to be the tournament to start sparking some stuff up in the SoCal scene. That was yeah. a beautiful win for Nido, and definitely a huge win for him on, uh, wow. Larry, yeah, Larry, like, what is yeah. happening?